I heard someone, dude. Porco Giuda! Vaffan, brodo! Sei un broccolone! How was I supposed to see this dude? I only heard a... For one second. And he's like... We have basically found out everything that we have to figure out to open the vault. We have to just get the sigils open with the codes. But we know where to find the codes and I hope I remember. And the figure carries the container down into a dark well. Yes, we remember this one, but how do we get there? Ah, yes, we have to take the raft that goes to that burnt church. And halfway through, we have to look to the right because there's gonna be a grabby grabby. Okay, let's be fast because I need to get to I need to get to the location before before the other guys come. The least amount of people we have at the party, the better. Oh, that sounds weird, but totally not the type of party that I want to find myself in. We want to be the first at the party, which is something that you don't want to do usually at a party because it's hella awkward to get there first because otherwise they're gonna eat ash, not ash, as Well, I just shut up. I think that doesn't matter. Even if we get there early, I think there's gonna be a lot of people anyways. Where's that be the case? I knew it. Hello? Hello? No! No! How am I supposed to go past this dude? Ah, maybe you gotta trigger them to look at me this way. So that they don't look at me he, when I go the other way. Oh, sheesh! Oh, sheesh! No! Dude, what am I supposed to do? Like, in the, this guy is just like... It's, why is there a goalie to this freaking fireplace? Like, just let me go. <laughs> this guy like... What are you doing? Get out of there, dude. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta find a shotgun. And then it's just like... In the head. That is the point. Like, I don't know if it's like a skill-based thing. Get out of here, Bajili. You get out of here. I'm gonna jump and you don't get me. Stop! No! This is BS, dude. I jumped and he's like, no, where are you go? <laughs> you wanted to. <gasps> the flood is coming. Maybe now I can do that. Jump! Maybe I understand. Maybe you have to get there with a raft. I never checked, but I think that you can get to the same location even if you take a raft, which is usually not the case with the other dream locations. Amazing, amazing. I think it's a good guess, but I don't know if it will work, you know? I don't think you can get off of here, actually. Can you? I think maybe here. Let's see if you can. Oh, yeah, let's go. How did you get here? Oh no, it's closed. This was supposed to be the way you do it. No! They ruined it. Maybe I'm supposed to open the door and then come here. Dang. But you cannot open it. Uh, ah, you have to remove that one. <gasps> okay, okay. Let's try. Let's try that. Oh my gosh. I just understood. Oh, do you see how everyone has their light on as well? Basically, they're also still, like, alive, sort of, in the dream. Because their fire is still on. Dude. So then, when we go to the first location, after it got flooded, all of these guys will have their lights off. So that means that they shouldn't be appearing. I hope that is correct. I mean, it makes sense, but it's kind of funny because, like, I mean, they're clearly not alive. But somehow, their dream form persists. Oh! Oh! I think that was perfect! Okay, now it's extinguished. I think that we can go back now. I hope the door stays open. I'm pretty sure they're not disconnected reality. So should we open? The door has to be open on the other side of the tunnel. Yes, it's open. Let's go. This is a very good sign. The flood is coming. I want to be inside when that happens. Please, please. Go, 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 go. Oh, they disappeared. Let's go. It worked. Let's go. Finally. No way. That's how you do it. Oh, my God. 
Let's go! Oh, the music. Look at all those reels. Uh, I hope I don't have to read them. Whoa, that is the... That is the sigil, the first sigils code. Insert artifact. Oh! <coughs> Ooh! Okay, they only let you read these two. Is this the same that we already saw? Ah, this is the <coughs> the one that is not burnt. Ah, these are the non-burnt versions of the slide reels. Ah, this part we didn't see. So they chop down all of their trees to make. They destroy their planets to make their uh, spaceship. Oh my gosh. Whoa, they were that desperate. And then they set sails towards the eye of the universe. Okay, now we get to uncover the truth about this. Oh, this one is new, I think. Okay, the guy is riding a raft. And there are those strange symbols in the sky. Why does everything look like it's in a matrix? You can jump off when it's dark? Are you freaking kidding me? Wait a second, where is this place though? Okay, here you have the big trees. And there is one rock on the side. One rock on the side and you can jump off. Dude. Ah no, I think you die. Okay, I thought it was like a secret. But we can still try. Whoa, super interesting. Oh no, it's burnt. What? Now that is unexpected. Did they do something wrong? Okay, this one actually caught me by surprise. I have no idea what it means. Maybe you have to do what... Uh... What the slide reel is telling you. There has to be a reason they tell you that you can jump off of that. It could be between the 4th and the 1st, to be honest. Which actually makes a lot of sense, because it's like the end of the full loop, right? Between the 4th and the 1st. Like, if there is a bug, the bug would be at the end of the loop. I swear, we are gonna get there in the right moment, so we can look at the code, and then just everything is gonna explode. Please! Oh! So that actually worked. No! So there are four different paths. So I feel like here we are in between the four dreams, aren't we? Aha! Wait a second. This is the... This is the first dream. Tell me that it's not burned. Please tell me that it's not burned this time. What? How is it still burned? What? <gasps> so you're telling me that... <laughs> this is just gonna turn off... The sigil? <gasps> it did! What? Now I understand. This is the bottom... Underneath the bell. Okay, I see. To reach that one, we need this. Uh, so we can turn this off. Uh, and we can turn off number three. But to turn off number one, we need the code. Also, I never put number two's code. Is it jammed? No, it's not jammed. And you have to do this all in one loop? Are you crazy? Now we need to get to the bottom. This is not the one. Ah, yes, and now I remember. The stairs, we have to take the stairs with the with the sign in front of it, and we just have to jump over it. Nah, perfect, perfect. There we go, and now we have to... <laughs> this is not a very efficient tower alarm, alarm tower. Okay, so now, you have to be careful, because there's gonna be a grubby grubby here. There we go. Wow, that was very well hidden. I don't think I would have ever thought about looking there if they didn't tell me. Oh, extinguish. Oh, okay, so now the well is completely dark. Oh, oh, 
Everybody's going down the elevator, dude. Dude! Everybody's going down the elevators. Oh no, man. That was, it's a game of hide and seek, basically. Oh. I heard someone, dude. Porco Giuda! Vaffan brodo! Sei un broccolone! How was I supposed to see this dude? I only heard a burp for one second. And it was okay, there's someone close to me, but I don't see any lights. And he's like, burp, burp. Dude. This game is freaking spooky. Now I understand why they had to add the, the fright thingy. Quick, 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 quick. There's definitely gonna be an owl here somewhere, right? No, don't leave me! No, they're coming down. No, no, they're not coming down, dude. They are not coming down, right? They are not coming down to chase me. Orca zoccola! Orca zoccola! Dude, I cannot see anything. No! I cannot see anything, dude. There is nobody here. <gasps> Stop it. There is nobody here. Okay. Okay, no, no, no. Wait, wait. I can't. I don't trust this. Why don't they give you a shotgun in this game? Why, why is this carrier doing amnesia? Oh, shoot. There are still people here. Ah! I see stairs. No! 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 Oh, it's actually fine, it's actually fine. Okay, how do you go there? Okay, I'm super silent right now. But I'm super focused, I see. Fudge! Dude, he had to be there! He had to be there out of all the places! Shh, guys. No, you didn't see me! Okay, we made it. This time that's it. Oh shoot. Dude, they even put one of those at the end. I mean, it actually helps. Damn. This is actually kind of complicated if you don't know where to go. This sound effect is a good sign. Please tell me that this time it's not burnt. I'm just gonna go in immediately. And it's burnt again. What is up with this being burned all the times? Aha, you see, this is the area where we were in before. We have to check out the slides. There are three? Let me do this quick. Okay, they scan the eye of the universe. They look at it and they know that everything is gonna evaporate and explode. And they're like, no! We're gonna kill it. Burn the church of the eye of the universe. Oh! This is where they created the vault. Oh, that is what it is. The antenna that we saw with the rays. It like engulfs the eye of the universe. Ah, it created like a barrier so that it would stop calling people from other worlds from coming towards it and that's why in the Nomai in the first game suddenly didn't hear the eye of the universe anymore so that means that the developers had already in mind that there was gonna be a DLC where they're gonna interrupt uh, the signals from the eye of the, of the universe because that was something that was not explained if I remember the story correctly okay ah this is how you link the fire the flame uh, to the brain. Okay, so you have a fire. Ah, the fire has like some sort of uh, hidden energy. You go to sleep, uh, and your brain waves uh, get somehow teleported uh, thanks to the fire in uh, the artifact. Wait, what? Some people can... 
and this is. Ah, but he's still alive. Oh, wait a second. He's like, come here. Oh, look at this fire. Oh. I think it's just it's just a way to explain that even when dead, you can go there. Okay. Okay, so they would get woken up with a bell, so it goes through the brain, and the and you can hear it also in the dream, and that way you can wake up from the dream, but not the dead. Ah, because if you were to use water, of course, it would also kill the dead, the dead's dreams, let's say. Ah, if there is no brain, <laughs> no brain, you don't wake up. Okay, that's it. I mean, we got all the information that we needed from here. <sighs> Happy birthday! What are the probabilities that that owl was gonna happen the same time I do that too? <laughs> what? That was actually kind of weird. <laughs> well, we're just gonna meet them. Yes. Oh, we managed to walk past this guy. What the heck? There's another one here for sure. Like there has to be one here. Because this area is two-sided. There's no way that this is two-sided. And there's no one. I knew it. I told you guys. I knew it. This game is... Dude, it kind of bothers me that we are going to have to restart this loop. No! Tomorrow we are going to finish this, trust me. Oh, shoot! Oh, shoot! Oh. Now we have to be very careful. So, we got uh, this uh, open. We can go down safely, I'm assuming. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Let's not assume that. I am pretty sure there is someone else here, actually. There is no way that this last part, there is nobody. Okay. That's the door that we have to exit from. No! Please. No, 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 no. Dude, what the heck? I knew it! There was someone hiding! Oh! Oh! Oh my god, did you see that? What the... Oh! That was so close! Oh my god! <laughs> Whoa. And now? How do you get to the... Ah, there is a light there! But I don't trust this guy! Oh, he did it again! This is the perfect place. <laughs> like, you cannot open that. Like, you're too far away. Ah, maybe you can just walk! Probably you can just walk, I didn't think about it. Oh my gosh, you can just walk, dude! No way! Now that the... Now that the... Loop is ending, dude. I was like, they're not gonna do it twice that you have to walk on on nothingness, right? Yeah, I should have just run away. Haha. -ha. Can I just walk? I don't think so. Maybe I can just walk also here. It was nice exploring this thingy. Now we have to do the whole thing again, dude. That is so annoying. We have to do the whole thing again, running away from the guys in the darkness, dude. Because they didn't try to... Oh, we're escaping! It's not like all the other games where people usually keep their lights on. No, this guy instead, like, turns it off. Dude, we're running! Look! Grabby, grabby! Oh! He cannot use the grabby, grabby! Let's go! No. No, run! I hope they don't follow me. I hope they don't follow me. I hope they don't follow me. They do not follow me, right? Go, 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 close! Insert artifact. Now give me some of those 
Reels. There you go. Two more reels. What are the secrets that we're gonna uncover? Okay, we're watching that one again. Okay, they're sobbing, looking at their old planet. This was the burnt part. Oh, they're using these kind of scepters to recreate their own planet. And that is the dream. Exactly. Interesting. Oh, another secret. Wait, can you even do that? Can you even leave your artifact around? No, you can't. Eh? I was like, how did we never try to leave the artifact? Wait, what? But Ah, you cannot do it when you walk. How did they never try this? Wait, what? Whoa! How did we never try this? There has to be someone who like thought about dropping it down and then just started walking and then was like... <gasps> Is my game bugged or something? Dude! Watch, watch this. <gasps> watch this actually have uh, the code. <laughs> Here's where you put the Kek W last. There's just so much to explore that I never even think about like dropping my stuff. Wow. Maybe you just have to connect the, all of the, the ending uh, reels uh, and you'll get it. Uh, what happens if I do this? Do you see the... Dude! There is another bridge! Look at this! Like, it's so easy! They don't see me now! What? It's also so mesmerizing. Oh, okay, it's here. I thought this was gonna bring us somewhere else. Okay, this is just a shortcut then. It would have been good to know this shortcut before though. There is one of these uh, reels which tell you a trick about uh, the artifact that I don't remember. It shows an alarm bell failing to wake up one of the stranger's inhabitants. That one was the other thing. But I thought it was only talking about people who don't have their brain. Ah. Ah. Wait. Okay, so how is this gonna help us? Okay, I think we have to redo this part because I don't remember. I just read that uh, thinking that it's just like, okay, people who are dead, they're not gonna be waking up by the bell. If their brain isn't connected, what the freak does that mean? Is your brain connected? Not in the game. Of course, you know the answer. And I'm gonna get hit. This rock loves to hit me. Oh, vitals critical. Wow! Did we really die? Wow. Okay, let's try to enter here. Let's try to sleep under the bell and see if we can figure out something if we leave our artifact somewhere. Okay, let's drop that there. Let's see. Oh! Ha ha! So that's how they work! They just move into place. Uh, wait, do you tell me that I can walk here? Ah, now I understand. Uh, everything is clear to me now. Oh. Basically, the second reel in every location is telling you how to get uh, to this place uh, without uh, knowing uh, the code. Uh, we've been able to get here without the code by dropping... Uh, out of the raft and we got here and we activated that then this one instead is telling us how we can pass this bridge by disconnecting our brain but that is something that i don't understand how to do and what what does it mean how do you disconnect your brain like if you if you somewhat die in there like okay and then this one instead was the one about leaving your lantern somewhere else but how does that help us ah i can use this 
No! What the heck, dude? What? That is amazing! I was like, how does this help us visualize it? And I was like, well, you just try it. That is so cool. Okay, so we can finish the game today, but it's gonna be so complicated. I must have missed something in that. I definitely missed something in that reel. Something about how to disconnect the brain or like how to be deaf somehow. <laughs> Yeah, you see, if you if you if you don't have a brain, there is no connection. Wait, are you telling me that you have to die? How the freak would you die in that room? You you finish the oxygen? Wait, what? Oh, this is interesting. I want to try something in the room with the bell. I basically have to die in the bell. Ouchie. Not here, in the bell. And I'm dead. What I want to do is I want to figure out how do you... But come on, guys. Uh, well, what is the probability of that... Fi Look! How many people... How many people do you think were able to flip one of these? Uh, I'm the only one, dude. The game doesn't want us to finish today. They just love us so much that they want us to continue. Oh, I can burn. <gasps> let's burn. Let's go. Okay, let's see if it works. Oh, let's go. It worked. Oh my gosh. So we know how to finish this game. I was like, how are we going to die? I was thinking, okay, we're going to have to use all our oxygen so we don't have any oxygen. But I was like, wait, that takes way too long. I don't think the devs would put something like that in the game. But there was the fire that actually burns. I never tried to jump in the fire, but of course it burns. So now we can go past this section. Oh, you cannot hear anything. Of course. Let's go. But the problem is like we did it wrong. Because now we cannot get access to the other ones. We have to get out. This is the last thing that we do. So I have to do this one first and this one I can do it later. I literally completely didn't understand that there was a tip on how to get past this bridge when we read that uh, slide reel the first time. But what happens now if I, if I fall? Am I gonna die? Aha! It makes sense. We're gonna do some achievements next time. Uh, we're gonna finish the game, of course. Of, of course, and let's not say of course. Let's hope we can finish the game next time. And then maybe do some of the achievements because we're gonna get this to 100%.